to find uh, the validity here we're going to use Pearson's correlation coefficient um, to create like a matrix so first you go to analyze okay then correlate and you choose by variate okay so here we are going to select all all the values and move them select options um, we want we don't need any of this okay here so we're using Pearson's two tails of course and it's going to flag any significant correlation for us okay voila here we are this is the correlation matrix as you see our values range from 0 to 1 and it tells us correlation is significant as 0 0.05 level and is also uh, significant as 0 0.01 so we look at the last column which is the total that's what we need right now so there are two ways to find the validity okay you can um, attempt to figure it out or to find it by the correlation uh, yes by Pearson's correlation value here we have 0 0.639 which is higher than 0 0.5 so it means we have a good correlation or moderate correlation we have moderate correlation and for the other also 595 which is moderate good but for the third one it's low low correlation um, okay low correlation moderate moderate okay and the, the last one is one of course is total so as you can see this shows that uh, the correlation is moderate and it means that our test is valid the second way is through the the significance we, you look at the significance value okay so if the significance is less than 0. Uh, yes if it's zero, less than 0 0.05 then it is valid 